The Government Accountability Office still conducts reports on the sale of surplus military firearms from the government to United States citizens. That is the point of this program, and it's been in existence since the early 1900s. In fact, it was initially created in 1903 under the Efficiency and Militia Act. That was the entire point, providing training for American citizens as what Theodore Roosevelt referred to as America's third line of defense. This program provides marksmanship training to American citizens all over the country. The biggest event, of course, happens during the national matches that at Camp Perry, which have been held since 1907. The Small Arms Firing School is directed by federal law, and it is instructed by the members of military marksmanship teams providing small arms instruction to American citizens. I find it very telling that someone professing to be a marksmanship instructor with the Marine Corps has no idea that this is happening. Probably because he never got picked up for the Marine Corps marksmanship team, which I think should tell you everything you need to know.